Hi. <laughs> Almost dozed off there for a second. I was trying to figure out the lighting, but you'll just have to live with it. <laughs> I uh, received a package. Oh, I'm Billy, the Crafty Floridian, if anybody's interested. I know you are. You wouldn't be watching if you weren't, right? Um, but I got a box today from a Charlotte Brown from Illinois. And I did open it, but I haven't looked at the end thing. She said, um, she said, thank you so much. There's the card. And it says, uh, completed hats were piling up, so I decided to send them all at the same time. Have already started more hats. Thanks again for all you do, Charlotte. Hats for kids. And that's from Charlotte. Okay, let's look at these hats. Okay, here we go. Nice box, big box. That's why I thought we'd do this. All right. Oh, look here. We got some more of these. The swirl. Isn't that pretty? That's a beige. Oh, it's so soft, too. Very nice. Oh, here's another one in pink. I notice she puts different, um, different, um, see how rims on them. Yep. Yeah. like the pink one too. I gave this, someone asked for this um, pattern. I believe he gave it to me, Charlotte, and I sent it to whoever asked me. Oh, here's another one, pink. Ooh, I like that one. Ooh, that's pretty. Pretty in pink. Ooh, yeah. Isn't that, that pretty? What's that swirl? Oh, swirls? Oh, yeah. Keep your ears warm when it's gold. Oh, that's so pretty. I like that. We got another one. Now this, oh, I like this one. I like this color. I love this color. Very nice. Oh, my goodness. Let's see if we got any more twirls. Here we go. Here's another one. These are just good, sturdy hats. These are so nice. Hmm. Got a fiber on the on the lip, and that's a it's a, it's a brown, light brown. Ooh, I like this one too. Ooh, this green one. I like this color. Isn't that pretty? Ooh, here's another one. Jeez, I think they're all the same. I'm getting overwhelmed here. Let me put some over here. Blue and red and green. I like the color. Ooh, it's so soft. Ooh, it's so soft. Very nice. Here's a nice, pretty, cutty green color. Oh, my goodness. Ooh, this one's heavy. Heavy. This is going to be warm. It's navy, navy blue and blue. Isn't that pretty? Pretty color combination. Boy, she's just whipping these babies out. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Got another one of these. Ooh, Charlotte, I love these. I love, love, love these. These are so pretty. Bobble stitches all over the place. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? I wouldn't have had the patience to have done that. I would have done it if I had to, but that's a lot of bobble stitches. Woo! Ooh, look at this one. Look at the colors in this. Look at this. Isn't that pretty? That's lovely. That's a lovely hat. They're, they're all lovely. Oh, so, oh, same same pattern. Boy, she whipped these babies out. Look at this one. This is a nice blue, soft. Very pretty. So now we're just looking at all the pretty colors because we know the patterns. Another green one. This is more of an army olive green, I guess you would say. Olive green. And here's another one of the different color blues. Navy blue, light blue. I like that color combination. I'm just sticking my hand in. Oh my god, there must be 100 hats in here. Look at the pink one. Another pink one. Isn't that pretty? That's 
try that myself. Another beige one. Pretty. Oh my gosh. Ooh, this is a pretty combination. I like that. Look at that one. Isn't that pretty? And a pretty pink. Hello, I love that pink. It's a hot pink. Hot pink for a hot mama. these back in that we looked at. That's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Ooh, look at this pretty pink one. I love that. Isn't that pretty? Look at the colors on that. Pretty really colors, isn't it? I like that too. Very nice. 1920 to 21. Okay, we're at 21. Pretty, look, she put it. Oh, I like that pink. The way you did the. Yeah. That's a pretty border. I like that. Brim, I should say. Brim. Ooh, here we go. We got something different. Look at this one. Wear it real slouchy or turn it up. It's a it looks like it's a full a five or six um, yarn. This is very nice. Y'all think I'm crazy, don't you? That's all right. Okay, here we go. Oh, here's one all colors of brown. Sorry, the lighting is really poor in here today. Browns and here's white with the pretty brim. Ooh, here's another bobble spit bobble stitch with the pretty brim. Real feminine. Another one. Oh, I love this one. Look at the colors. You can't tell. It's purple and lavender. Let's see. Can you see it now? Yeah, there you go. Uh-huh. There you go. You can see it now. Isn't that pretty? Ooh. Oh, look at this one. Ooh, this is pretty. Look at the bobbles. My gosh. Beautiful color combinations. Ooh. So soft. Ooh. Get that there. Here's another brown one. Nice. Fit very nicely. A blue one. Ooh, look at this one. Black and it's black and gr olive and light green. Pretty though, isn't it? I like it. I like the way the stripes came out. I do. I like that. Another pink, pink bubble. Bubbles. Bubbles. And this color is a gray. Another pink. Very pretty. Oops, wait a minute. Here we go. And another pink. I think that's it. Oh my goodness. I started another box and it's half full. This is going to fill it up, I think. I got... Um, I got this. I got like four or five boxes out there. I got two full ones for the kids in need, and that is going to go out. I'm going to stop. I'm going to drop it off at the UPS place. And uh, yeah, they will come to my. Yes, I know you're going to say, well, they. Um, I know you're going to say that they will come and get them for a price. Okay, so I check all that stuff out. Oh my goodness, look at all these. Aren't these beautiful hats? Thank you so much, Charlotte. These are absolutely gorgeous hats. I just love them. I think they're so pretty. And this pattern is just gorgeous. And you could do so much with the brim. 
making all kinds of different brims. Very, very nice. I love them. So these will go in the box for the, or I might just leave them in that box. I might leave them in that box. And then I could fill up the other box that I have here that I started uh, yesterday with the, with the hats I got earlier. And uh, oh, I'll save the tissue. Save that. Um, I haven't um, I haven't accomplished too much. I'll show you what I've done so far. Um, what I've been working on. Uh, tomorrow I go to pick up my new member of my family, my little new kitty cat. You move this mount. Maybe that glare will go away. Oh, I guess I need that glare, huh? Anyway, um, my new kitty cat's coming tomorrow. I'm going, I'm going to the cardiologist at 1.30. And then after that, I go and pick up my new cat. No, I don't have a name for him yet. I'm, I'm working on it. I'm working on it. So, I, today I made a market, a market bag out of the uh, plastic bag prong, long, or whatever you want to call it. But I made this, finished it off this afternoon, started it last night before I went to bed. And uh, so that I could fill it up for. So I made her a uh, potato bag with the kitties, with the kitty cats on it. And I made her a cozy bowl with the kitty cats on it. So that goes in there. And some other things I'm going to throw in there for. And I see I made a, I think you saw one like this. But I made another uh, project bag with a with a pocket in it like I did the other one. And uh, so I have that if any, anyone's interested in them. And look at this. I took, remember I showed you this fabric? Well, I'm in love with it. I wish they had had more. And I'm going to be, tomorrow when I go to the doctor's, and I think I'll be close to some other Walmarts um, when I go pick up my baby, that I'm going to look and see. I did, did it in red. I lined it with the red. And then check it. But I love this. I just love this. So I've got one cut out now to make another one. But yeah, I just love this. And um, I want to make a, 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 boat, a, a bowl cozy to go with it. And the other thing is, remember I, the new fabric that I showed you? Well, I made a project bag out of it. Isn't it cute? It's so cute. And I lined it with the red. And I didn't line it the real fancy way. I didn't have my pink and shears haven't come yet. So it's a little gnarly inside. But it's 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 done. But isn't that pretty? And I had some blue, uh, two different colors of blue cord left. So I figured I'd just use that with this. And it goes with the blue, blue J in here. But I do, I just love this material. I love the way it came out with the birds on it. And this one's more centered. But isn't that pretty? So, um, I was going to make a pocket, and then I decided against it. Uh, because it would take more material, and I didn't want to waste the material on it. So, there's my, my little project bag here. And, what else did I make? Oh. I finished the freaking barn, and I put the barn on. Here's my barn. I changed it a little bit. A lot. <laughs> Oops. Oh, I'll get this up so you can see. There's my barn, and I did a like a like a a slip stitch to get this border here. And then I did a little, a little embroidering here because I wanted a little more definition. And then I just did it all, did it all in the round. And then I had, <sighs> then I made this look like the side, and I kind of puffed it out a little bit so it gave it more dimension, which it did. So I thought that came out okay. But 
that's my barn. I like I like a barn that I can see straight on, you know? So yeah, so phew, this is done for another what month? So what what whenever she does it, right? So we got it while yet, but like so that's done. I'm gonna put this away for a while. Okay. Um, I did a little bit of work on my um, on my beach cover up. Not much, not much. I just I did another pattern, another full pattern. So it's it's coming along. It's looking very nice. So I can't wait to get more of it done. And I think I'll be able to now that I have um, got all the stuff that need to be shipped out and the and the giveaways done and all that good stuff. Um, I did work on my top a little bit, but not much. You know, I got a, a couple more rows done, but that's that's about it. And I haven't done anything with the squares. I haven't done anything with the crochet along. So that's that's about it. I did get. Um, a very nice crochet sister sent me um, like um, eight, 12 more, I guess 12 more of these. So I'm going to do the, um, it must be my eyes, it's so blurry. Um, I'm going to do um, the whole thing in white. I think everybody's right. I think the white is the way to go. So that's good. And when I was, and then I got two more things to do that top with, so that's good. And I did get some of my plastic done. I got one more bag of plastic to um, lay out, and then I, what I do is after I lay it out, you know, I get a big stack, and then I roll it and tie it until I get ready to cut it and all that stuff. And that's what, and that's, and then I roll it up, and but that's what I use now to do this. To just to do this bag, I went through almost three balls of this big just to do this one little bag. Well, it's not a little bag. It is a big bag. But I had promised her I'd make her one. And I just made the, um, this. So, yeah. So, that's what I've done. I've been sewing a lot. Let's see. I see. I think some things I've sewn, but they're they're going to be uh, shipped out. I started. Um, I've got an order for another Billy Damn It doll, and I started her. Oops, excuse me. I started her. There she goes. There she is. And I ran out of big brown eyes, so I got to use little little brown eyes. So then I give her more shading here. But anyway. Um, yeah, I started this, so I want to get this done and get it mailed to her. But yeah, I've started her, so it won't be long, and I'll have that that I can whip up like that. I just I'm gonna I gotta I'm trying to decide what dress to make for her. She wants it with a little dress, I think she said. So I was, um, you know, that uh, last dress that I did, and that's gone. That's mailed out. Um, I sewed it. Uh, you know, I hand sewed it on. I know. I know I shouldn't have done that. But I did. Anyway. But things were a lot better in the sewing department today because of my new bobbins. I was able to put uh, the thread on the bob, you know, for each color that I was using because I used some new colors with the um, thread. So I really like this. Let me know if anybody would like it. I can always make another one. But, um, yeah, and this is, this other one is part of the Goodwill material, so that's, this is like 10 bucks for this one, and then this one is lined and everything, I can't remember what, I don't know, I guess I have come up with something, the shipping and, oh, I'll come up with a price, I can't. I made one for um, 
I made one for Deanna, but I put pockets in it, and it was a lot bigger than this. And I charged her like, I don't know, $30, $30, I think. So, and it's almost the same size, but I didn't put pockets. I could put pockets in it, I guess, but I didn't want to waste the material. <laughs> so, we'll come up with a price if anybody's interested. But, ooh, excuse me, my eye itches. So, that's, that's it. And, and I have this, you know, I have this. I'm going to make a cozy to go with it. And I have another one cut out already to make just like this, potato bags. So, and you put corn, tomatoes, uh, to, tomatoes, potatoes, corn, anything, that, a veggie that you, you know, that's not watery or something that you could put in here and bake. Um, I've got to make one for myself, tell you the truth. I like the way I made this. <laughs> I'm getting better. The lines are getting straighter. My, um. My sewing machine has a little bit of problem with thickness, so that's why I'm hesitating. That's why I don't do a lot of, anyway, I don't iron or anything. I just sew it together, but I thought it was nice. So that's, that's all I've done, guys. Uh, except packing everything up. I've got to put, i got to put my um, cat, little cat cage that I have. So I could go get my new cat, and then I have to sneak. I have to sneak, sneak it in tonight or tomorrow. And we have a we have two side doors, so I go. I'm gonna go to this side door over here on my left, so that uh, no one sees me sneaking her in or sneaking him in. And then we have to come up with a name for him. Um, and the reason I'm videoing tonight because I probably won't video tomorrow. We have the um, Billy's Live at um, 10 o'clock tomorrow night. I was thinking of moving it up, moving up, but I'll, I'll keep it around 10, 9.30, 10. And um, I'll show you the new, the new Boozy Cat. <laughs> I keep telling Rosie she's going to have a little brother. Oh, I'm not, think she's not too happy about that. But we'll see. We'll see how it We'll see how it does. And she told me uh, on the phone last night that if uh, if they didn't get along or whatever, I can I can it's a guarantee I can take him back if it doesn't work out. But I don't know. I've never had any. I did. Now wait a minute. I did adopt. I, I adopted a cat. God, I can't even remember her name. It, no, was it her? Yeah, it was her. Well, she was probably the meanest cat I have ever seen. She was destroying my Jessie. And not too long after, I, ha I had to take the cat back. Cheryl, I know you're listening to this and it's probably breaking your heart, but I'm telling you, the cat was beating me up. It was beating up Jessie. Jessie was here a long time before that cat was here. It's the first cat I've ever known that I could not train. She was just the meanest thing. She hurt Jesse and she hurt me. Um, it was, it, I cried all the way back when I turned her back in. I cried all the way home. It just broke my heart. It even breaks my heart now that I had to do that. But, and to think Jesse was Jesse couldn't sleep. Jesse couldn't go anywhere. She was backed up into a corner because that cat would attack attack him, you know. And um, to this day, I believe that he went under was under so much stress that you know about a month or two later he had a heart attack and he died. And I I think I always blame myself for bringing that cat into our house. In the way that uh, I let it go on too long before I had to take him back, take her back. But she was she was the meanest cat. Somebody had mistreated that cat terribly. But she was a mean cat to my Jessie. I just could not bear it. I had almost forgotten about that. Ah, oh, I'm sorry, Cheryl. Don't cry. I'm crying myself just thinking about it. But. Um, 
I did. I, I had to take it back. She just, she was just bad. I mean, really bad. Excuse me, I gotta get a tissue. But anyway, we're not here to get all teary-eyed, are we? Huh? Nah. No, no, no. So nothing adventurous happened today or last night, or since the last time I talked to you a couple days ago. Uh, I just got the one package, and that was all the mail that I got, except for the ice yarn that I got yesterday. And, um, um, Dina, I have been working on, um, I finally had time to sit down today, and I worked on the, um, uh, your nice gift and I like it I like it it's so light I like it and it holds the battery for a long time so I um, I tried I tried videoing a little bit today so I've got to do some fine-tuning and all that good stuff so I think it's gonna work out okay also I want to thank um, Jane Wynn from um, sc scrap scrap Yarn artistic or what? You know, I cannot remember that name. I'm sorry, Jane. But anyway, I went on and I downloaded Handbrake that you said you use for uh, videos and stuff. Well, I downloaded it. Now I got to figure out how to use it, how to get to wherever you get to to do things. Excuse me. Um, so I need to work. I need to work on that. But thank you very much. And then. I have one of the webcams like you showed in the box. Well, I have the exact same one. And I'm going to let you know a little secret. I did not realize that on each side of this camera here is speakers. I didn't know that. It shows you how much I read, right? I don't read a lot of directions, I guess. But my boom box work, working. I put... The uh, battery's in, and she's all fired up and ready to rock and roll with me tomorrow in the car. Yes, sir, Rebob. So, now I'm going to have to be careful about locking my car, because I don't want anybody to take my little boombox. So, I'm off to, off to get my old ticker checked out. And my new medicine is, I, I feel a lot more comfort. I, I can't explain it to you, but... I feel like um, something's been lifted off my chest, I guess, with this new medicine, new cart medicine, and blood pressure medicine, and um, the AFib has calmed down. I don't know. I'll talk to the doctor tomorrow about it. Um, they'll probably do an EKG and all that junk, but um, to check on the AFib and stuff. But but it it just and I believe it it's. Blood pressure is still in sort of like in the yellow, you know, in the yellow uh, area, and but it's out of the red, thank God. Like my sister said, uh, she couldn't understand why I wasn't dead. <laughs> oh well, we live and we learn, don't we? Um, I think that's about all I'm going to say tonight. I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. You see my new baby, and I'm going to get the hats repacked up and I'm going to do some work on some of my projects tonight because I'm not going to sew anymore today because um, I got a cramp in my thigh sitting there. I can't sit too long in too many places so I have to move around a lot. Oops, excuse me, I'm sorry. Did I hurt you? <laughs> I don't want to hurt you. Uh -huh. With my Popping around my camera. Oh, I have to tell you. Um, I think it was Alicia. She said, oh, I remember I told you the last one about the snowstorm and all that stuff. She says, oh, I remember that in 1978. Well, honey, this was long before 1978. <laughs> I think it was around 60. Let's see, we moved in together at 65. So it was around 66, 67. 68, right in that uh, time frame. It was a good 10 years before the one you're talking about, the snowstorm. 
So anyway, I just wanted Alicia to know that. So Alicia's, Alicia's from Virginia like I am. So, in fact, she lives in the same city that I, or town that, uh, that I lived in. So, um, but I, I, I saw the old Falls Church and she's in the new Falls Church. So, and I'm going to make, uh, scarves, I think with the squares. Yep. And I might even start deciding what I'm, color I'm going to put between some of them and make a nice pretty scarf. I might make a boy's scarf. So I might get Get some, uh, I got some light blue around here on somewhere in some, one of these boxes somewhere. I'm still working on trying to organize what I have, but I haven't um, gotten too far on that. But I got to get some projects out of the way first, right? Okay. Well, um, that's it. I'm going to say good night. And I will see you all tomorrow for Billy's Live at 10 o'clock. And we can um, come up with a name for my new for my new boy. I hope. <laughs> I hope he comes out. I hope he's out. I hope he's got a lot of problems. I just don't need a lot of problems. I just want a nice little pussy cat. He should be all right. He should be all right. He's, uh, he, two, she's already uh, adopted. She had four. She adopted out two already, had two left, a boy and a girl. I said, right away, I want the boy. I don't care what the girl looks like. I, don't, I want a boy. I just think a boy and a girl get along a lot better. And I like male cats. They're much more friendlier than females. But, oh, y'all have seen Rosie. You know how she's always uh, bumping up to me and everything, you know, sitting in the chair. I don't know where she is now. But I'll tell you what, if I was to dial Cheryl... And if that cat heard Cheryl's voice, she'd be in here like a flash. There's something, she's got this thing for Cheryl. I don't know what it is. I think she knows that Cheryl is an animal lover. The way she talks to her and everything. So, it's funny. It's just so funny. <laughs> oh, my gosh. So, I'm going to say goodnight. And I will um, see you all tomorrow night. And I'll show you my new pussy cat. So have a good night. Sleep tight. Don't get let the bug, 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 bug spite. <laughs> Jeez. I hate it when my tongue gets all ripped up in my mouth. And I can't say anything or remember anything. It's crazy. So thank you, Jane. Thank you, everybody. Uh, thank you, Charlotte, for the beautiful, beautiful hat. Oh, my gosh. They're going to be so excited when we drop off all, when they come and get all these hats. It's going to be wonderful. So I'll see you guys later. Take care. Remember, tomorrow is Pussycat Day. Bye.